Welcome to Create Your Own Paradise. We are a world schooling family of four traveling through Europe. Our dream is to create our own world schooling hub. But first, we have put the travels on hold and are going to create our little paradise here in this beautiful community called Malama. If you haven't seen our last film, click here and learn more about this place. As you might know, Jasper has a passion not only for filmmaking but also for natural building. As the old community oven at Malama wasn't functioning well, the plan was born to hold our first pizza oven building workshop here in Portugal. Yeah, we're building a pizza oven here. We uh, organized a workshop because they, uh, yeah, they had a pizza oven, but they weren't that happy with it. There wasn't a roof as well, so it was very hard to get it hot. And um, as I'm a professional pizza oven builder, I said, uh, okay, I can organize a workshop. Uh, today is D-Day, that means the dome day, so it's a very special day. Yeah, it's a pizza oven built with natural materials, mainly clay, straw, empty wine bottles, sawdust, and it's going to be a great oven, I hope. Uh, there will be a pizza party with all the participants next week, and then we see if, it, uh, if the hard labor pays off. It had to be wheelbarrowed up about 30 meters, maybe 50 even, and 200 meters away, so it was a lot of uh, hard labor done by all the particip participants. Yeah, so we're making these little breads, we call them, loaves of bread, loaves of clay, and then they are packed onto a sand dome, the inner shape of the, of the oven, and we can let it dry for a couple of days, and then it's the, the moment of truth. Then we're going to dig out the sand and then uh, we hope and pray that the dome keeps its shape. The workshop is uh, yeah, it's also more than just building a pizza oven. It's an introduction into natural building, building with natural materials. There are several techniques we use to build this oven. We, uh, we use clay slip to um, make an insulative layer with sawdust. We, uh, we use clay as a mortar on the, on the side where we made a, 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 a containment ring. And we use clay with straw for the entrance where it's extra strong. So there's a lot of different techniques in. And yeah, we hope to empower people with this workshop that natural building is fun. And yeah, if you get the hang of it, yeah, you can really build everything with your bare hands because yeah, it's not, it's not toxic, it's just a lovely material. Yeah, today is a big day. We built the uh, oven dome on Wednesday, on Sunday, and today is uh, Wednesday. Uh, it's quite hard already because uh, there's a lot of wind. The indoor shape is made of sand, and that's where we built the clay dome on top. And today is the big moment that we're gonna take out the sand and hope that the thing will keep its shape. So we prepared the kitchen a little bit to. Uh, not make it too messy here with all the sand because it's, uh, it's a lot of sand that will come out. Let's see if we can get it out. Whoa. 
Okay, this is the moment to start the epic dramatic music. Deze even omwisselen. So we're gonna light the oven for the first time. It's really wet inside, so it's always a bit tough to get it going. But it's a good way to let it dry and let it everything settle. So I would say, start epic dramatic music track two. The oven is almost finished. Today we're putting an insulation layer made of uh, clay slip and sawdust. And then we're almost there for the pizza party. Ah! Oh, sorry. That was a That was a moment. Today is the inauguration of the oven. So the first time we use it, it's always a special moment. We also attached uh, yeah, the pizza party to the workshop. So here are some of the participants. They're gonna eat the pizza from their self-built oven. And uh, Nico, what do you think? I think it's really good. So far, so good. We used a part of the old oven, as you see the arch there. And then, yeah, we just put the new oven behind it. See what comes out. Together with, uh, I think, eight people or nine, we, we built a pizza oven. We did a workshop uh, a pizza oven building with, uh, with natural clay. Learned a lot of stuff, uh, a lot of uh, different techniques, also to check the clay, check the, how it dries. We really learned a lot about uh, the materials that you can use to build the oven. It was really interesting. It's almost like building an onion with so many layers. It feels very good to work with your hands in the, the moisture clay. Harvesting the, the soil close to, uh, to your living space, it's, it's quite unique. Mm -hmm. And it was also nice to, uh, to have the children around and uh, they played with the sand. And it was a really relaxed uh, atmosphere. So that also helps the workshop to be uh, to be a good um, thing. <laughs> the atmosphere was very good. We made some good friends, nice friends. Mm -hmm. There was also a good cook here, but I guess with a good oven, he doesn't have to work that hard to make it uh, taste good. And that's what it is a good oven. It's real good. Crispy and them. Yeah, delicious. So yeah, this is the side view of the oven. In short, what's really important, a couple of things. So here we have the thermal mass layer that goes even underneath. That's the dense clay mix. Uh, then we have an insulation layer made of sawdust and uh, clay slip. And then we have a finished layer made of lime. Yeah, the insulation layer keeps the whole thing really hot. It retains the heat well. And then we have an insulation layer underneath with glass bottles filled up with sawdust. And also on the side. And then one more thing that's really important is the ratio between the height inside and the height of the 
opening the tunnel and that should be 63%. So that's why 40 centimeters inside, 25 uh, for the tunnel. So this is what we built. Now you know. Prachtig.